Hey guys, my name is Sidney Egg and welcome back to Nautical Life. In the last episode guys, we finally got that nighttime fishing rod and we're currently doing the challenge where we need to get uh, a bunch of fish together. We missed out last episode on getting one more Napoleon fish, which I legit low-key have got it, but there's another one that's appeared anyway, so I'm going to grab that before he runs away or swims away, should I say. So if I head back down to Central Point at the sushi restaurant, I did it. Nice little crate there. And I got nearly over a thousand experience points, so it's all looking good. We're going to set sail back home now because we got a bunch of fish to sell. Not only we got a bunch of fish to sell, guys, but I left you all with a question. And the question was, guys, what do I do about the boat situation? Because your boy wants to buy a new boat. Now, I'm in the market for buying a new boat. We need to get to South Shore because them prices are crazy. So let's do that first quickly. I could either buy the 50,000 point, uh, a 50,000 dollar boat. I could buy the 80,000 dollar boat, or if I saved my pennies just a little bit harder, I could get the 120,000 dollar boat. And a lot of you guys were saying, just get the 120,000 dollar boat because you can just you, you can collect more fish in the long run. And I thought to myself, you know what? It, 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 yeah, it, you are you are right, guys. So we're we'll head to South Shore now. Drop these boats down, these fishing boats, so I can start farming a lot of beautiful fish. We're going to set sail back home. And in the store here, we're going to buy the Phantom Boat, 120,000. And what that does for us is, it enables us to get 250 fish, whereas the other one, the Red Atlanta that we currently got, only gave us 100. And it's going to give us 120, um, 120, 1,200 experience points. So I'm going to buy that. Yes, bubba boy. Look at that for a beast of a boat right now, guys. That is legit a beast of a boat. Let's actually uh, look at my XP points now. That's crazy. Let's actually uh, do some shopping in this. And I want to get some furniture. So, I think I'm going to buy one, two, three, four, five marble floors to fill that top deck there. So, my boat on the third floor, I drop down. Some nice looking marble. And you know what? Actually, I've got to return back to my previous boat and remove some of this stuff. So I want to pull it on the new boat. It's quite annoying that like you can't... I mean, can you sell a boat? I don't know if you can. Because it'd be nice if you could. Because I, I don't know why I would ever want to go back to any previous boat that I own. So I don't know. It's a weird one. So this is the top floor then for furniture. I'm going to drop a sofa in there. There we go. For no particular reason. And I have my little fish dinner there. Which is going to be tasty. Second floor. I've got eight of those. Third floor. Wow. We've got a lot to place down, don't we? I do my best with the wooden flooring. It's not going to go too far. But we're going to make this boat eventually look pretty fancy. That's where that ends. We'll drop one of these there. And maybe put our fish tank there. And I'm pretty much out of all the furniture. <laughs> That's all I had. So let's get out of here then. That is a pretty sweet looking boat if you ask me guys. And we're going to have a bunch of room in there to collect so much fish. So unload, 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 unload. We got a new boat guys. It, it, it's going to be a beast of a boat. A beast of a boat. So, yeah, we're going to try and work now towards grinding to get up to the next level. It will take some time, obviously. But what I want to know is, does buying these fishing boats also go towards my XP? That's what I would like to know. Because I want to max out the amount of boats, obviously, fishing boats that I can, I can buy. Uh, not really, no. I can't buy any more of these because i got to rank up a bit further. So let's sell some fish. Do you know what? No, I'm not going to sell the fish now because the price of these are is actually good at the moment. Um, I don't want to ruin it too much. I'll sell anything from a uh, southeast point now. Maybe to increase the price of these. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. So what challenges we got going on today then? Crazy challenges. That's what challenges we got. West Bay. He had a crazy challenge, right? Yeah, give that up. Right, next... Um, a free meter from West Bay at night time. Right, I'll accept it just to give it a go. We got some koi carp coming in. Just 
stand car. Let's see if I can get one of these up here. Is it what what color is it? it? It is like silver, like you know, not rare. And it needs to be over three meters, and that one's one meter. How are we gonna get a three meter one? That's two point one. I don't think we're actually going to find a free meter one of those. I'm not even sure what you, how you even pronounce them. Daytime is coming as well, so we need to hurry up. 1.6, uh, a para... Piraraku. Is that how you say it? I don't even know. Alright, we, we got a little bit more time to go. Come on. 2.6. Ah, uh, you know what? I'm not going to be able to get it because my fishing run is dying. Right, okay, fine. Forget that then. Save sure. Let's unload. So I want that sweet money. Sweet cash money moolah. That is the worst rod to have right now. <laughs> right, let's grab that. Right, we're all looking good then, aren't we? Yeah. Let's grab a puffer fish for, for, the, for the giggles, for, for the lols. Right, you know what else I want to know as well? Does... No, okay. It's a different type of orb altogether over on this side. So we are going to have to grind very hard for this. But you know what my problem is? Let's go back home and I'll show you my problem. When it comes to the fishes and the rod, that next shark is needs to be... Um... Well, it goes up... To, well, it's the, it's, the, it's the piranha, isn't it? It goes up to 19 on its side. And my 17 rods don't quite match it. The 18 might be good enough, but we might need to wait for the myth rod to go up to 20, where it has a bottom end at 10. That's the kind of thing we're probably looking at. And that master rod is 200,000 as well, so that's... It's crazy. And we might need to buy the fishing net just to grind the cash money moolah. But we'll see how things go anyway. We're collecting a ton of fish right now. The amount of fish that we can collect them and catch is ridiculous. It is ridiculous. I feel like I want to buy some more fishing boats. There. As many as I, I as I can buy in like them areas will be handy. Would legit be handy. Right. Okay. So what's our rank in them? We've got we've got a long way way to go with all that. Any um, good challenges you got for me? <sighs> no. <laughs> Refuse. Uh, your boy Harold over on West Bay normally has some good ones. I can't do this one, I'm afraid. Uh, refuse. What about in the house here? Yeah, info. Nah. Nah. This one's one Piracu there. I should have just caught one of those. Would have got the hourglass. They could be possible. They could be possible. A three meter one. That's just like ridiculous. When we get in one meter ones pop up and stuff like that. So I wonder how far I can take this in before it then turns around and goes, You can't catch no more fish, you fool. That's what I like to know. Alright, some shrimp. We're getting the wrong rod as well. Well, it is becoming nighttime. Have we got the nighttime rod on? No, I don't. There you go. Nighttime rod. Oh, can I catch one of these? I give it a go though, guys. Tell you what, I'm giving it a go. Come on. No, it's taking too long. Right, unload. Unload. Unload all of those. Get them out of the way. Perfect. 148, uh, 47 tuna. I'll wait for this one to be collected and before we sell them all. Right, let's scout around then. Any crates in the water? None that I can see. Uh, no. What's this over here, by the way? Coming soon. Look at like a Japanese ver like symbol over there. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, how far are we? We're not too far now. I'm gonna click my own black merlin. Have I caught one of these before? No, it's the first time I collected one of those. Wow. Didn't know that. Okay, right. I think we should sell some fish now then. So let's get back. Fishies! 
34,000 in tuna we can sell right there. That is ridiculous. It's not affecting the prices of anything right now. Do I just grind a few more shrimp before I sell it? Set sail. Oh, nice crate there. I feel like I should. Well, I'm making so much money today. It's unreal. What do I buy with that money? What am I saving up for next? Well, it's definitely going to be the new fishing rod, but I got to get to level three for that. And I know that's going to take me some time to get up there because it's took me a while to get up to here. The only reason we jumped so high is because I bought a new boat. All right. Unload these guys. They got a load of fish for me. No, I'm going to buy more fishing boats. That's what I'm going to do. So do you know what? I ain't going to mess about. Let's buy them now. All right, fishes. It's gone down to 32,000. Right, I'll sell it anyway. 7,000 for them. We're going to go over to... Where should we go next then? Hmm. South East Point. West Bay for some trout and stuff. I don't know. It's a tough one. But I'm going to buy some more boats. And so I can't buy any more of those. Can't buy any more of those. But how many more of these can I buy? Okay, I've reached my limit on all of those boats. I've got five more of these to place down as well. Wow. Right, we'll drop some of these in West Bay then. So five of these over here. <laughs> That's just crazy, guys. That is legit. That's just ridiculous, the amount of boats we've now got. Set sail, south shore. I'm going to remove two of them. Hang on, let me set sail back to West Bay. So we got four there. Three there. And I'll drop three over here as well. So we've got boats in all different places just gaining me so much fish. So the grind for this is like, this is, we got, we got a small little army on the go. We just gotta make sure that I do keep going back and forth to each area. Look at that. Eight trout. I mean, when we collect so many from all these different areas, we just keep coming back and forth and checking it out and then selling fish at different times. You know, just to get like the good prices coming in. This is legit. We got 10,000. So I've 100%... Oh, I got the wrong rod on. 100% maxed out on what I can get at the moment. I can't buy any more boats till I level up. Have I ever got one of these? I don't know, but I struggle to even get that. That's crazy. All right, some sea bass coming in. A barracuda. Easy. Oh, I just clicked off the game on accident. Right, save short. No. West Bay. Yes. Get me that trout, please. Now, it is getting dark. So I could get one of those Piracu, what are they called? So I will have to switch to my nighttime rod. Oh, that's bait. My nighttime rod now anyway. Is it the right time for this? Not quite. What was it he wanted again? For the hourglass? Just one. Just one for an hourglass. So we're in the zone then for getting it. It's just when's it going to appear? There's some nice carp coming in. Nope. <laughs> Later. There we go. Right, let's. Oh, it's 3.1. Right, we've got one. Can I get that dude's challenge? Refuse that. Refuse. Seventy thousand. Right, I try and click the number one now. Holy moly. That just came out of nowhere, didn't it? Right, will I find another Piracu, whatever they're called again? There we go. Pira... Pira... Achoo. It's like Pikachu, like a Pokemon, isn't it? There we go. We got it. So let's empty these boats then. Look, the whole time they've been here now, we've actually got quite a few fish. Right... Trade one of these then. We've got two of them, weirdly enough. We earned an hourglass. The next one. 
I traded for two. Do I get points on that? I think I do. I don't know. Uh, right, let's set sail now to the places that emptied these boats. Unload all of those. Set sail to South Shore. Unload these. There we go. Set sail back home. We're going to modify my own boat. And I place these. I place one on this floor. One on that floor. Nice. All right. Fish then, we're going to sell them. So, what's got the lowest price? Well, what's got the highest price? We Technically, we don't really know. But I sell everything from South Shore to ride the prices up for um, South East Point to ride the prices up then for West Bay. Kind of thing. That, that's, that's my kind of ideology behind all of that. And now we've got 46,000 in the bank. So, we've had quite a successful day. We bought not only a new fishing boat, or a new boat for ourselves. New fishing boats. Uh, we're on the way to leveling up as well. So hopefully I can get the master rod soon. But I think next episode we should we should actually buy the fishing net. And start to grind the XP levels. Because if you can catch between 1 to 3 fish a time. If I catch 3 fish. It's like 3 times the XP from just normally fishing. It's not a very high range. So you know, we're not going to be able to do too much with it. But in the store... I wonder, what, what, why, why do we need a helicopter on this? I don't know. I legit don't even know anymore. But when it comes to boats, again, if I'm not, you know, if I wanted to buy another boat while I can legit afford at the moment, I wouldn't buy the 170. I bought the, the 200,000 one because the statistics are so much more better. But we'll see how things go, guys. We'll legit see how things go. Hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, smash the like button down below if you're new. Make sure to subscribe. And until next time, I'll see you all soon. So, good. Bye.